I'm Felicity de Kogan and I'm a research fellow at the Institute of Microbiology Infection at the University of Birmingham, UK. My research focuses on topical drug delivery to the eye, particularly the back of the eye. Currently, um, all patients have to have an intravitreal injection for diseases like AMD, and we want to stop that and allow them to have topical delivery instead. Our previous work showed that we could, in rodents, uh, deliver anti-VEGF therapies like Avastin and get the same outcomes as if the drug had been injected. So the poster I presented this week uh, scaled this up to pig eyes and rabbit eyes, which are the same size roughly as a human eye. And that's a really important translational step because it shows that this has a real chance of working in humans and will mean that patients don't need to have injections anymore. It worked really well in both rabbit and pig eyes. We got good delivery to the back of the eye and got therapeutic levels. So it's been very successful so far. So we have a really uh, interesting project starting up soon with Macrogen Inc. in the US and Queen's University of Belfast in the UK. And Macrogen have a fascinating new drug which treats dry, dry and wet AMD. And we're working with them to ensure that when that gets to patients, uh, particularly for dry AMD where there's no treatment at the moment, it will be delivered uh, topically rather than having patients go through injection regimes. So nothing is commercially available yet, and I believe a clinical trial for the dry MD drug is starting in the US next year. I hope it's going to be really soon. I think it's really important for patients that they have access to this. When we talk to patients about AMD, the thing that comes up most is that they have to have these injections. It's incredibly distressing. Uh, it often leads to side effects like breast attachment, which means they have to have further processes. And these treatments that we're working on with Macrogen will mean that patient, it really empowers patients. It gives them control of their own treatment. Instead of having to take a day off a week to go into hospitals, have, have injections and all the side effects that goes with those, it means that they can see their doctor and just get eye drops prescribed. They can treat themselves at home. And that's really important for them. And that's the real driver behind these projects. We're currently running a disease model in rabbits which shows that, hopefully, <laughs> we'll show that um, we can get the same outcome whether we intravitreally inject or deliver with our cell penetrating peptide. The data so far looks really good, but we need to finish off the study. So uh, there is the University of Birmingham website, and I'm part of the Institute of Microbiology and Infection. So they can look up my research there. And also Macrogen has their own website, which is uh, www.macrogen.com.